Hello guys, today I'm coming to you with positive vibes, spiritual vibes, godly vibes. How good God is. We are spiritual beings and we are creations of God. So it's only right that I make a playlist for praise and worship gospel i've been compiling a playlist over the past three years of all my favorite gospel tracks and i know there's going to be stuff that i miss out there's so much goodness so what i'm going to do this is the playlist here and i'll like show you in another clip how to get to it because it's a public playlist so if you do want to follow it i'm going to click shuffle and then we're gonna we're gonna enjoy we're gonna be in the presence together the Bible says where two or more are gathered. So I'm here, you here, and if you're watching with your friends, your friends here too. Let's go. William McDowell, stop, stop. When you hear William McDowell, you know it's going down. William McDowell, because it's going down. William McDowell's songs always come with the just fairy tale instruments. Do you know, do you know what I mean? A love that's indescribable. Connect more to gospel songs that are very simple because at the end of the day, don't beat around the bush, just tell us how you feel, you know, tell us the experience, and that's it. How can I describe deep it? A God that is undescribable. How can you describe God, the creator of the earth? Wow, I feel like I'm preaching right now. Take your seats, okay? How could you explain a love? A love. God's love. You see, God's love it doesn't give up on you. Overwhelming unexplainable you, you can't explain it someone asks you why are you a christian why do you love god why do you believe in god listen i'm at a loss for words that's what you need to tell them i love this song so much you can be free you can be free you can be whole so tell everybody that doubted you that discredits you that doesn't value you that god came and changed your life. Whatever you was going through before, whatever you thought you was not capable of, whatever you thought you couldn't do, he cleaned you up inside and he thought you were worth dying for. Okay, so don't let nobody, don't let nobody's son take you for idiots. Cause you can be free from that. You can be a whole person by yourself. Praise him. Same way you praise and worship all these artists, yeah? Did they give you the breath of life? Did they make you free? Did they make you whole? Did they let you empower you to tell everyone that you know? Whenever you're going through battles with the enemy, okay, he said weapons will form, but he said they will not prosper. No weapon. Whether it's a bullet, arrow, a knife, a person, a situation, it won't work. Stand your ground. Don't let anybody rattle you. A whole God is by your side and you're letting people rattle you. Stop. Let's stop. Give yourself a moment of silence. A whole G-O-D. The creator of everything. Every human, everything. And you're letting common, common little thing rattle you. Stop. Stop that. Stop it. Stop that you will not not today not ever if you can't tell i like i like simple songs simple chords simple message and i feel like those are the ones that really came from the heart because the heart is very simple it either loves or it doesn't think about it i'll just say yes that's all you need to do to god you lead the way you know the ones where the drums come in you feel you feel something shifting in the environment something shifting in the atmosphere and you're thinking brian what you gonna do with it brian what you gonna do and there is peace i don't wanna be this way no more make me over you know what this song would be really good to play when you want to repent for something Oh holy father If there's something you ever want to turn away from A habit, a person, a situation You 
you feel like your heart and your soul has been troubled, compromised, make me over. Give him the room to do that in your life. Like, we actually used to give him the room to do that in our life. You know when you just hit, there's a song that just moves your spirit to the point where you just cry? Lord, I must say, you got me wondering why Yo, deep the lyrics Like, sometimes you actually have to think, why? Why choose me? As flawed and as crazy as we are Why? Oh, why? Yeah. Why is it me, Jesus? Please tell me why and I don't have a spectacular bone in my body, but you love me anyway. Sometimes, just thank you. Don't even ask. Don't even ask. Just thank you. Thank you for clarity. Thank you for understanding. Thank you for love. Thank you for grace. All the blessings. Thank you for the things that you protect me from. Thank you for the things that you keep me from. Like, just say thank you. Thank you. Thank you for another day to say thank you. Oh, that's powerful. We're gonna stay right here until you change. You see, sometimes, yeah, when you're dealing with something, just stay still. Stop trying to overcomplicate it. Stop trying to just stay still. Listen to God's instruction. Feel His peace. Feel His clarity. This is actually making me emotional. Honestly, guys, if you genuinely feel lost, any sort of unrest in your life, if that's even a word, trouble in your life, please, please, please lean into God in prayer, in song, in words, just because it's a, it's a different, it's a level that is unmatched. Take God seriously and he will take you seriously. Like he loves you, but he will take you seriously. Light in the darkness, my God, that is who you are. In my mind, I am. That's the best kind of free to be. Free from all the nonsense the world spews. Free from all the nonsense you believed about yourself. Free to choose to do better and be better. Listen, I better be speaking to somebody today. You can be free from bondage and heal from brokenness and full of joy be free lift up your voice and say now you know how much you listen to a song when you know all the ad libs by his hand we're made free that's crazy the power of sin is broken jesus overcame it all oh, william 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 Really truly blessed, truly Nothing gifted. Happens in your world that kept the pen by the Nothing. This it's song, if you're in, if you're just feeling alone, or if you're just feeling isolated, and I want you to know that your father this song is just so. Hmm, it just gives you peace. That's what all of this is about, honestly. Peace of mind, so that you can actually live the life that you're supposed to, that God has ordained for you. Why you are on this earth. But sometimes you just need that comfort. Sometimes you just need, because he's a comforter. So sometimes you need that. God will always be there. We're like his, we're literally his children, we're his babies. So even if you feel like you're too tough, you're too cool, you're too bad to accept help, or someone like me, I just don't like asking for help. I just feel like I should do everything on my own. I'm just very self sufficient. Sometimes you need to know there's somebody there that you can go to and they'll actually wrap you in their arms. Sometimes you just need that affection, that reassurance, that comfort. Yeah. This next song, let me set the scene, okay? Um, if you lot don't know about the Loco wedding, Carl Loco and Cassandra Loco, stop. Stop, hashtag locked in. Yeah, I'm a fan. But um, I don't really, I don't say goals to couples anymore because you just don't ever know what's really going on behind the scenes. But if you lot haven't seen their wedding video, yo, that that was an experience, beautiful, a movie, all of all of that and more. So, anyways, that video introduced me to this song. So we're gonna get into this song. Oh crap.
bigger than all my problems and every situation there is nothing too hard for the sovereign What my desire is to know you and to be clothed in your glory. That's really what we need to be doing. She said, Lord, my desire is to know you and to be clothed in your glory. So I feel like too often the way people view God, or maybe let me just talk from a Christian standpoint. God, us, God, us, God us and because it seems so far away it's just like uh, and then we fall on we fall off into the wayside and we kind of just dismiss that but it's actually a relationship a relationship goes stale when you stop being when you stop being interested but that's just a byproduct of something else you know you stop wanting to discover more and learn more about the person you feel like okay this is everything i know about the person and then it gets to the point where you're not growing so it's either still and it's dead or it's that dynamic is so similar to the dynamic that we have with that dynamic is so similar to the dynamic that we have with god and especially if you're not in places and surrounded by people that teach you more or let you see different different perspectives and views it's very hard for that relationship to continue to grow and be sustained so i think it's one of them things where even i've struggled with this Feel the presence and then you rush to be in a relationship and you're really interested um but then it all just goes still very quickly because you were just looking at the you were just looking at the miracles and the grand gestures it's almost like when you go out when you start going out with someone you may almost be distracted um by the grandeur of it all oh, they've taken me to the shard and oh they've done this you haven't actually stopped to really see the person but once all those things are stripped away you have nothing to stand on and i think that happens a lot when you, like you first become saved or um if you were saved in like this big big grand way and then you might think that the journey from then onwards is just miracles and just amazing which it can be but at the same time you need to learn more about him and his character and his nature and his promises when that desire runs dry you need to you need to figure out how to plug back into that this is turning into a little bit of ministry but i never really planned it to i just wanted y'all to see what i be you know what i be listening to when i want to be in the presence of god you feel me if you want me to do a part two with more songs um let me know and also i'll do a part do a part three with faster gospel songs um because i'm aware that sometimes if you want to transition from listening to to listening to more gospel songs from other songs i don't really like to compare them but if you do then there are a lot of songs out there that you can listen to you just gotta know where to look and i feel like not a lot of people are directing us to those places so i'll link some youtube pages that actually have good playlists so if you want to listen depending on your mood because it's not every day you want to be crying and doing all of that sometimes you want to be doing other things so there's lots of music for that sorry i'm talking fast my battery is dying but thank you so much and honestly just god bless you all and i hope you enjoyed it leave a like if you felt touched and if you like my little mini sermons in the in the middle, Pastor Jared are coming through. Check in on the next video, guys. And bye.